Hello and welcome to Zigbeans. We are here in Mumbai at the launch of this new, well, not new, but updated uh, Aprilia's and Vespa's. I'm next to the Vespa Note, the 125. Now, of course, this is not exactly a new scooter because this color was launched a couple of months back, as was this matted in the Vespa 150 and a matte yellow as well. So if the colors are not the real new part, what is? Well, there is an interesting feature but we'll get to that in just a bit because firstly, we have to talk about what Piaggio is doing with the Aprilias. Now, as you go towards the Aprilias now, the first thing I want to talk about is this one, this blue. Now, this blue was available only on the SR125 and well, now it's there on the 150 as well. And there are new stickers as well, like this big A on the side. It does look pretty sweet. But I think the biggest uh, or the nicest color update that they've got for the April SR150 has to be this carbon edition because in grey and with this carbon fibre sticker, it looks pretty sweet. But of course, this is a limited edition, which means if you want to get yourself one, you are going to have to really hurry. But is that all? No. There's a lot more because I think the biggest uh, update has, of course, has to be on the April SR150 race. Now, they've had the race edition before with the red wheels and the different paint scheme. But here what they've done is they've changed the paint scheme a little bit. It's white at the front, black at the back, and the stickers now resemble closely the Aprilia RSGP, their MotoGP bike. And I think it looks very, very sweet indeed. And for this year, Aprilia is also sort of updating. Uh, they're going a little whole hog on uh, the SR150 race. So they've included this uh, air brake, <laughs> okay, windshield on the bike as standard and they've got a new mat down there which looks well quite neat but i think the biggest change that is there on all the april sr 150s has to be the instrument cluster now it's a semi digital unit which means there is an analog speedo and a digital unit which of course has your trip meter your odometer your clock and your fuel gauge but more than that i think the biggest update here has to be well of course not this sticker but what that sticker indicates because that sticker means that this is the connectivity version now what that means is that this scooter has a module which enables you to connect your phone to the scooter using bluetooth now the system is not as comprehensive as that as you've seen on say something other like pbs n talk but it does allow you to track your past rides so the last five rides can be tracked in the app uh, it can also help you schedule services it can help you locate your scooter uh, it can also help you uh, there's a assist mode, like in case you're in trouble, uh, sorry, a distress mode. So if you click the left, the indicator on the left four times, it starts the horn uh, and the uh, lights and basically it uh, sends a message to two people on your contacts list, uh, giving your exact location. So yeah, in case you're in trouble, that should help. But more than that, I think what the biggest change, the biggest mechanical change on these scooters or the Aprilias has to be that rear shock right there because now that's adjustable of course when i say adjustable it's adjustable only for preload it's a five step system and that will of course well it doesn't make it more sporty but it does let you allow it allow you to customize your riding experience to your needs so yeah that pretty much wraps up uh, these scooters now of course this currently module is available not just on the aprilias but on the vespas as well now it's a little strange because if you want it as standard you can get it on the race you can get it on the carbon and on the uh, Vespa 150 is standard as well. But if you want it on the Vespa 125 or the standard 150 SR or the SR 125, it's going to cost you about Rs. 1800. So yeah, that is it for these new updated Vespas and Aprilias. No, not, nothing is really exceptionally new in that sense, but they do add some features that should really enhance uh, the abilities in terms of the Aprilias and the aesthetics in terms of the Vespas.